this is teacher grandma, teacher for 34 years and a grandmother of two pretty little girls. I have heard many times people saying to me, ma'am, I find it very difficult to say no. Now, believe you me, I did not have a no muscle, but it was my husband that taught me to develop this muscle. I will tell you that one, one day I had a lady that had come to my house and it told me that she wanted me to tutor four of her children. And I said, no. And she said, you're going to tutor. And I was a bit taken aback. And she said, I'm coming tomorrow and I'm going to tell you what fees to charge me and what time to take my children for tuitions. I was very taken aback, very disturbed because I had little children at that time. And my husband who was having tea with me the next day found me uncomfortable. And he said, love what happened. And I said, no, you know, this lady is going to come and she's not ready to take no for an answer. She wants me to take her children for tuition. I don't know what to do. And he said, problem, you say no. And we'll see what happens. So I was very, very excited. The lady came and she said, I'm going to pay you so much for the tuitions of my four children and they are going to start from Monday. And I said, no, I'm not taking the tuition. And she said, no, Lena padega. And I was completely taken aback. My husband turned to her and said, she said, no, she's not taking the tuition. What do you think happens? The lady picks herself off my chair and leaves my house. Says thank you to me and leaves my house. I did not expect that to happen. And so when I pondered over what my husband did and what I did, I said the same thing that he did. But I realized that the tone of voice, my voice, had kept it up for discussion. So when you say or no, say or no, like there is no negotiation. Oprah Winfrey always says, say it as a full sentence. No, I'm not able to do it or no, I am not doing it. Say it as a full sentence because when people ask you for a certain thing, you have a choice to say a yes or a no. And if you want to say a no, you are free to say a no. Oprah also said one thing which I use very much on my children. She said no is a two-letter word. It begins with an N and ends with an O. Which part of it do you not understand the N or the O? You won't believe. When things were not up for discussion and I said a no, with this as a full sentence, my kids never questioned my no. And so I say to you, develop your no muscle. Because it is a muscle, the more you exercise it, the better you get at using it. This is Teacher Grandma signing off, wishing you all the best with your know.